play some clone drone in the danger zone. I have completed most of the challenges. All the ones that give upgrades. So I'm finally ready to do the random upgrade challenge because unlike most of these challenges, this one actually includes upgrades that you've unlocked from other Trace challenges. And some of them, namely Fire Breath. Uh, broken as fuck. It's starting me out with a hammer. I want to take out this archer, since I don't have any uh, ability to deflect arrows. And, uh... Defeat. This human fell quickly. That's fucking depressing. That's why not, Domingo. And it started me with a bow. This is maybe my favorite challenge. Okay, we're gonna forget that that last attempt hit. We're just gonna go with this one. All right. This is with Bob's tier. So we're just four little one swordsmen. Silver, gold, diamond, titanium. That one didn't count. Uh, I'm gonna go over to the spikes and just let these guys kill themselves. As much as I'd like to kill them all with a bow, it takes a long time. Oh, I'm the pyramid. No. The bow is really awful a lot of the time. Like, you have to actually be really precise where you hit. Alright, this time. Come on, sword. And a cloak. Clone created. I've only done this challenge, this is the fifth time. Although that last one didn't really count, so I guess I've done this challenge four times and got past level one. Every time it gives you clone first. Alright, no spikes on this level. To one-shot something with the bow, you have to hit it in the head, in the neck, or waist, and sever it in half. The easiest one is the head, but the problem is, is that they, these things are jump randomly. Got them both, perfect. Victory. One level down. When you upgrade arrow width, it's much easier to kill the the bow, just because you can you can shoot it like the torso and cut them in half really easily. Come on, sword. Alright. That's actually a good upgrade. I have two arrows now. Uh, Mark II hammer pot. This guy needs to go. Ooh, nice two for one, and I got his leg. Okay. The problem with the hammer bots is they're very thick. And it's very, very hard to kill them with bows unless you get them in the face. And with jumping around, it's going to be kind of hard. Alright, that'll work. Victory. You can also kill something by severing both arms or both legs. Although kick bots can lose both arms. This level is so dramatic. I like it. Come on, sword! Yes! Thank everything. I'm the trophies real quick. Really cool. Red right, sword is good. Sword is really good against hammer bots. Alright, level 2. Archers. They. What sucks about these guys is they strafe. I'm just gonna go sword and just get up in the face. Okay. Wait for him to shoot. Got him. Victory! Excellent. The human is getting there. Pretty good. What is next? Swords clash on a narrow bridge. I'd really like deflect arrows, block arrows, or more energy capacity. 
Got another clone of me, I guess. Created. All right. Oh, I really hate this one. Got it. Okay. I didn't get that second archer. They got one arm. Now they're all just trapped down there and they're gonna get cut now. Perfect. This, this level is just really nerve wracking because it's really easy to accidentally uh, fall down onto a saw blade. Alright, block arrows. Alright, this is the fucking run. Now what I really want is energy energy capacity up so I can maybe potentially get flame breath. Because if I get flame breath, the rest of this is super easy. Alright, let me try to chop one of these. Oh. No, oh, I raised my sword so I didn't fucking... I might have been at a bad angle too. Thanks. Alright, let me try to get the hammer bot. Oops. easy. I'm just gonna stand right here. Victory. So hammer bots are actually really easy. They telegraph their moves because the hammer has such a wind up. Um, if they do a horizontal strike, you just jump. And unless they also jump, which is it's very hard. They, they typically don't follow you. They typically jump randomly. If you jump, you dodge horizontal. You can just strafe to dodge vertical. All right, fire sword is pretty decent. What fire does is if you um, if you nick a, a body part, it will burn some of the like a better word pixels of of the nearby parts of the uh, robot's body. And if it hit, if it tags something vital like the neck or the waist, then it will it will kill it. See, I actually killed that thing despite not hitting it in the eye, which typically you have to do, because, uh, I have Fire Sword. Actually, Fire Sword just allows you to- Ooh, that was my fucking leg! It just allows you to be less accurate. Okay, come on, buddy. Okay, this is really bad. I don't really have the mobility to around oof. That should get him. Okay. God damn it. What's nice about Fire Sword too is when you get Fire Sword, if you deflect a, an arrow, it becomes a fire arrow. God! Victory. Yes. Alright, let me hobble over there. So now what I really want is either jetpack <coughs> or repair. I need that leg. I have a clone, so I can afford to die, but I really don't want to waste that clone since I unlike normal modes, I can't guarantee I'll get another one. A deadly combination. Also spikes. Hooray! Hobble over to upgrade lock. Come on. Jetpack, jetpack, jetpack. Wow, I got kick while I have one leg. Boy, I, I literally can't use that, so it's nice. Alright, well, let's try to use the bow at the very beginning. Oh my god, kick bots. 
I don't have the get up quickly perk, so I'm potentially boned. Once I kill this, it's actually easy since I can deflect arrows. Oh my gosh, come on. Oh, they're barely missing it. Got him, okay. I just gotta hobble my way up there. Everything's easy. <laughs> this is actually funny. Right, keep it nice and low. So when you can't control blocks, they 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 just they go at reverse angle. So being at a lower altitude than these things makes it impossible for me to reflect it back at them. There we go. Victory. So I actually had to go up there. Go human. All right. Call that a free round. Those those kickbots were annoying, but ultimately didn't contribute anything. Oh hey, here comes Spidertron 5000. Oh, Spidertron with Everyone one leg is really and flame members with one leg is really bad. I need a repair or a jetpack. Oh well, at least my arrows are on fire, I guess. Fire arrows are good for um. Both Spider-Tron and Raptor. Raptor, if you hit him in the head with an arrow and it's on fire, it's basically a one-shot. Because if you tag their spine, they die. Alright, let's go here. That should be one. Here. Oh, I just clipped his jaw. I got him. So, those things breathe fire. And the problem with that is, is I don't have the mobility to strafe it. Or anything. Wow. Victory. Pretty round. We were handing out medals. This human would get a gold. Instead, we will watch the human die. That's more so flame metrics are interesting in that their behavior pattern is really bad for like versus bows, as in they kill themselves to bows because they run straight at you, yeah. and the first thing that they always do is breathe straight forward, so they lower their head. And you have about two seconds to land a shot. It's very easy. Yes! Alright, I have mobility again. Nice. You know, it's ground level mobility, but it's mobility. Uh, I'll probably stick with the sword. Let's see what we got here. A Spider-Tron, level 3 sword bots. Ooh. Level 3 bot with a bump. Oh, okay, that's really bad. That's really bad. Really bad. Really bad. I need to take out that spider bot ASAP. Actually, I need to take out these archers back here. Okay, good. Nice, I tagged his dome. Maybe that'll get him? Nope. Yeah, okay. So now that's left is the... These two dudes. So these level 3 samurai bots can block arrows. Ooh. Wow, that was really good. He did like a shallow jump. They can deflect arrows when they have their swords out, and they always switch to swords when you get close enough. Since I don't have a hammer, the only way I can kill them is with sword, but I can kick. I can kick them over. They have to get up quickly, Brick, so you gotta be quick! Victory! Somehow the human is still alive. It is some kind of wonder human! Rank 3 bots are very unpredictable in their movement. They jump at random times. It's exclusively. That is how you get up on top of Little Hill. <sighs> Alright, clones are good here. God bless. Clone created. Alright, I have a decent amount of perks. So, I should be able to roll through the rest of this. Armor would be another really good perk. Alright, let's see. I want to take out archers first. Oh, there's an archer on the ground. Perfect. I want to line it up so that he kills these guys. Nice. That's 
So I want to knock these archers onto ground level so I can use them to kill people. So you go down here. And then I stand over here and I let things come to me. Wow, he didn't deflect that. Alright. Perfect. Alright, I killed that archer. That's fine. I'm gonna kill this one while I'm at it. You can kill certain things like archers and uh, hammer bots just by killing, breaking, or destroying one of their arms. Because they need two arms to wield their weapons, so the bot will just kill itself. Got him. Sweep the legs. <coughs> nice. Alright, so armor is nice. Fire sword or block arrow is also nice. Get up is oh, get up is nice. I submitted the point where I just have really good perks. The bad perks would be like hammer. So I don't really want a hammer. Okay, this one. We got level three hammer bots. Fire fire swords. Um, yeah, I need to take out this spidertron ASAP. I'm just gonna cut his legs off. Ooh. Alright, he's in balance, that's nice, but I need to cut Shoot. Alright. I'm gonna kite for a bit, and I'm gonna try to... <gasps> Frick! I have my sword out! Okay. I really want to kill that spider bot, because it poses the greatest threat. A random... Oh, my frame rate's dog shit. Something fell in lava. Because this is what happens when stuff falls in... Oh, the spider bot fell in lava, yep. Alright, my frame rate's gonna be really bad for a little bit. Alright, the rank 3 hammer bot just killed itself. They really need to fix how lava destroys frame rate in this fucking game. Okay, there's you. That firebot killed himself. Alright. Well, it cost me my clone, but the round's over at least. Dead bot just oh the dead bots hit the fucking bounce. Alright, I have to go all the way around to get that guy. I don't wanna risk pulling out my bow and shooting an arrow because the rate at which these guys fire is somewhat random. Like sometimes they shoot and then they wait, and sometimes they shoot and then they shoot. How long does this human have left? Not long. It's one of the main flaws of this game is that performance right there during the yeah, lava. Just, just, just goes to shit. Alright, that's nice. Alright, I have no clones, so I gotta pick kinda safe, but I do block everything in front of me now. Okay, so how this map starts. Ooh. This map starts as I kill these guys and the walls will drop and it will reveal a much larger map. And there's the frame rate drop because there are more flame raptors. I've got a pyramid going. Let me get up top just for a second. I don't think you can kick raptors. It would be quite interesting if you could. Alright. Oh, that was really close. The flame was dangerously close to me. Alright, so if I just run at him in vertical slash, or yeah, vertical slash, that kills him. Victory! Everybots have to wind up. So, if you're within range to sword slash them, and you attack at the same time, sword always wins because it's faster. And flame sword. 
pretty much guaranteed wins, because even if you're off a of vital. We can do enough. Alright, block arrows, clone, armor. Clone is good. Clone created. Nice. Alright, six more levels. <laughs> There's that fucking sp oh I hate this level so much. Getting to that spider bot up here is like impossible. So what I want to do here, I want to take advantage of spider bot to kill these high rank hammer bots. Nice. Oh, no. oh nice spikes get him nice okay. Now I can kill the archers slowly. I just gotta speed up top. There's one. Like. <gasps> oh god, this could be bad. Yep. Alright. Well. There goes my clone again. Unfortunately, you don't roll forward when you get up forward. You uh, you just kind of stand up, and if I did that, I would have died to spikes. So, there's no getting around that. This is a rank 3, no doubt. Yep. God. Victory. Not clean. I dealt with the hammer bots pretty well. Aside from... Almost getting smashed in the head and having to and now, have having to basically no die. No <sighs> All right, last clone. clone I need to make created. this clone last more than one round. Nice. Let's see what the human does with it. I'll start with the bow out. All right, billion hammer bots. Did I get him? Yes. Alright, so, I'm gonna be abusing the fact that you can jetpack with your sword, like, slashed, and you can, like, lance people to beat this one. It's gonna be a very long process. The problem is that the rank 3 hammer bots are actually quite fast, and they strafe. So you have to, like... You have to, like, lance them. Oh. That was cool. You have to, like, lance them in a turn, but I guess I can horizontal strike. That was at the very end of my jetpack. And these guys I can do without games run up the... Nice. Victory. When will this human die? I need to go to the bathroom. No, I am a robot. Okay, armor is great. Flame sword is great. Reflect oh, again is so great. Perfect. Okay, this lets me abuse the hell out of archer units. Upgrade bot is the best. I basically don't have to pull out my bow anymore, except for flame raptors. Oh, uh, speak of the devil. Thank god that hit correctly. Alright, flame rate drop again, because there's lava on this level. Oh good, that guy killed himself. I can just aim at this dude. That dude. Victory. Hello, I am in the danger zone. You are not alone. Armor, armor, armor. Come on, armor. Yes. This is the fucking run. All right. So this essentially is. 
immunity to damage from everything once aside from my face. Oh, good, they're fucking archers. Oh, and a jetpack bot. Alright, I need to get this uh, Spider-Tron dead. Spidertron should hopefully knock itself over into the spikes. Okay. Okay. Come on. Deflect over at him. Okay, I'll just go just the old hi ya. Oh, he's not dead. That should get him. so it's easier to do this. Okay. Victory. That'll take a while. Jetpack bots are actually pretty dangerous. As I demonstrated earlier, the jetpack sword attack is very strong. Okay. This is a perk I don't typically choose. Because <coughs> I don't really need the jetpack to be faster, and it, it makes the timing of the swing a little different. This is fine. It's not a bad perk by any means. Uh, only melee units. Oh wait, oh, there's some fire archers somewhere. Oh, and these guys deflect stuff, perfect. All right, we're gonna be using the jetpack technique here because, as you can see, the fire archers like to move. Oh. They like to, like, strafe while we shoot. That should get him. Not that hammer bot out of the picture. Nice. Jedi Master. Nice, they turn into melee if I get close enough. There's one leg. They turn into range again. Be a far enough away, I guess. Wow. Alright, two more levels. Two more levels. Hammer's not that bad. Alright, let's see. Just four Mark II hammer bots. Okay, this is not too bad. A way I like to deal with these is with the kick move. Wow, I just got fucking owned. Alright, well. Let's try the kick move again. I don't know if they have the get up. Doesn't 
doesn't seem like it. Alright, wow. I played that. Victory. Played that poorly. Trying to fight them like... Alright, well, I can't get any more clones, so this last level has to be perfect. I have arrived. Oh, fuck, this shit is easy. Oh, it's the... Is that what's it called? The Fleet Overseer. Alright, so the Overseer is like a crab bot that shoots a chest laser from the ground up vertically. So you just have to strafe that. When you destroy their spider legs, they float around and have a sword and become melee. And armored... armored uh, hammer bots, okay. This is fine. This is actually not bad at all. So, whenever you hit something that's armored and break the armor, you uh, stagger them. So I can trade with these hammer bots really easily. I don't have to worry too much. So I'm going to keep to the outside, stay away from the overseer. Do a, one of those. Do some jetpack move. Strafe, strafe, strafe. Strafe, strafe, strafe. The Overseer is really good at not friendly firing most of the time. Did I get him? Yes. Okay, jump back out. The Overseer is a really cool uh, unit to fight, but it's a little bit too easy. I actually have to play like such a bitch, but this is how it is. And you can't hide behind these bullets for cover. Wow. I'm like being very inaccurate. I just break the armor off of that dude's fucking leg. Oh man. Okay, I got another leg. Oh, I got him. Nice. Can't really capitalize off that, can I? Oof. Okay, that's his leg. Almost got that friggin' hammer bot. Oh! Alright, this dude's entire right side is unarmored. Nice. Okay. Now comes the fun part. So, next time it does a laser, I'm gonna try to horizontal cut jetpack attack its leg knock it over. So you just gotta... I just knocked the armor. Okay, that's its right shoulder armor. Wow! Okay. I need some distance. <laughs> that's, that's scary. Okay, one leg gone. That actually makes it more dangerous, the laser's off-center. Alright, hang on. Okay, that was a risk. I can't use- I can't use arrows because they take too much energy. <gasps> Holy <laughs> I clenched real hard for that one. What the fuck? What is this? 
the physics behind that maneuver. Okay. Alright. Overseer bot, go home, you're drunk. <laughs> it's climbing up walls now! <laughs> Yes, that was so close. Alright. Nice.